Hey guys, this is a mega news flash. I, you guys, y'all have been watching, anyone that's been watching what I do, I decrypted the US currency years ago. Uh, it, bills that no one else knew what was on those bills. That is an identical match to the side of the building of the Alfred, Alfred P. Moore building. We have an image of what looks like the Twin Towers. And now I'm just gonna go ahead and turn this over and I'm gonna show you. There's also another image that's right above this line that will be a Pentagon. Every time you fold one of those bills the same way and turn it upside down, you end up with an image of a bombing of one of the buildings in the United States. I'm going to show you the old $10 bill, or the latest $10 bill, there it is. That's a tidal wave coming over a building with a radioactive sky. The sky is radioactive, there's a nuke in the background, this is a tidal wave. This is a building right here, and when I move my hand, you will see this building's reflection in the water. There it is. This is the water right here. Okay, that's the $10 bill. The $100 bill has come out, the new $100 bill. This is urgent, viral, get it out. It's coming, I guarantee it. The prophetic utterance the Lord gave me in 2007, it is, many of those things have already happened. This is the end of it, get ready. Thus saith the Lord of hosts, behold the hand of the oppressor has been lifted against you. And out of the sea shall come fire and smoke and a devouring wind. Water as high as the walls of Jerusalem shall cover the city by the sea. And great shall be the destruction of that city. Behold the man of peace, Barack Hussein Obama, and with words of peace, he will bring chaos and destruction. Uh, it, it does seem to be that it could have quite a catastrophic effect. Uh, we're talking about uh, global economic financial chaos is what's being described. Why did the United States attack Libya, Iraq, Afghanistan, and Yemen? Why are US operatives helping to destabilize Syria? And why is the United States government so intent on taking down Iran, in spite of the fact that Iran has not attacked any country since 1798? And what's next? What are we headed for? Here is the new $100 bill. The tin has been turned upside down. Anyone that watches my ministry should know what that means. Here come contrails of missiles right here. Here's a contrail of a missile coming in, exploding coming in from this side right here, exploding. The reason I'm showing it to you on this is because once you put it in a higher resolution, it's difficult to see, but with the naked eye, here again is the control coming in, missile exploding. This is gonna be New York City, and you're gonna see the water coming through now after this. Here are the buildings, here are the buildings right here. See the buildings right here? Okay, you see all this um, ink right here that makes the unidirectional lines? There's darker ink in certain spots, you'll see it. Okay, these unidirectional lines is movement towards the subject, which is us. As I, as I change the magnification, you're gonna see all of this, all of this is gonna turn to waves coming in from those nukes that went down, and they're gonna be destroying the city, watch. Here it goes, there it is, see it? See how it changed? See how it gets all fluffy? Boom. There it is, buildings being wiped out. There it is, see the water? That's water, I'm gonna go back, look. There it is, now picture the water coming at you. Boom.
Now picture the water coming at you. Boom, 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 boom. Devastation. Let me show you what's going to precipitate that, which is on the new $100 bill. It's coming to New York. I guarantee it. I prophesied it in 2007. It's on the 10. The Hoover Dam also event is going to happen. They've cleared out Lake Mead. I don't know when it's going to happen, but it's going to happen. It's printed on the money. Okay, let me show you what's going to cause this. Here's the other side of the $100 bill. I'm going to enlarge it. There you go. There, it, This is all water splashing up. This is a missile right here. There are the fins of the missile. Here's the fuselage of the missile and the head of the missile impacting into the water. This ink represents the water going up and a nuke. Watch as I change the magnification. Ready? There it is. There it is. There you go. That's what's coming. Now all you have to do is go watch the DVD we did, Destruction of America or Crowning the Tyrant. And you'll see other images on the US currency that have all been hidden right in front of your face. But if you look, there it all is. See the different layers of ink? Watch what they, there's a missile hitting. There it is going in. There's the water coming up and the nuke beginning. There it is. All right, also on this, this bill there is there's this blue stripe. It's a hologram. What it is, it's, if I move it around, it's the Liberty Bell and it's ringing. If you move a hologram, the hologram moves. So if that, there was a clanger in there and it's going like this, what would it be doing? It would be going ding, 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 ding. They are sounding their alarm. This bill is a vehicle to distribute their plans. That's what they're doing. These are their plans to nuke the United States. It's Satan's plan, by the way, Satan and the fallen angels, but we have members of our government who have been taken over by demonic spirits, and they're part of this. There it is. This blue line, it also represents a water event, and it's the bell ringing. They're ringing the bell, and I'm ringing the bell. That's what my name means. Yahweh always given a bell ringer. So I'm sounding the alarm. Prepare yourselves. I don't know the hour, the day, the month, or the year, but I'm telling you it's coming no matter what. In the story, folks, get ready. Jesus is coming. So is the end. World War III is upon us. It's the Liberty Bell and it's ringing.